so Matron, how does it feel like to be a mother to the women here? Uh, I think uh, we thought of sharing, isn't it? In life, you know, we got to share. I'm quite fortunate because I've got all the opportunity to live, uh, supposed to be more happier, you know? uh, but uh, they need our guidance. Uh, and then, uh, fortunately, in Rumah Soleha, we tell them that we are a, like a family because we introduced the family concept here. Uh, the residents and also we have got home base. So when they come to room, uh, this house, uh, we tell them this is your house. And every one of you must play a role to make the event successful if you have got events, you know. I know this, I understand this is a, a halfway house. Yes. So they're not here permanently. Yes. Usually how long is their stay and what do they, what happens when they're with you here? Uh, minimum of six months here, uh, maximum of two years. When they came here, they are on stretch on the stretcher, you know, sent by the ambulance with the uh, skin lesions, uh, very weak. Uh, so the first thing we have got to increase their self-esteem, self-esteem first. So telling them that you are not going to die now. We have got cases who have been living more than 20 years. Uh, so uh, you have got to be strong and we are here to help you, but only a certain, certain aspect. Uh, most of the aspect you have got to do yourself. It all comes from your own uh, heart. So once we have tackled the, uh, the self-esteem aspect, it's easier, much easier. Uh, so we introduce uh, the cleanliness, each aspect, the well-balanced diet, all the positive thinking and spiritual enhancement. Well, tough love is uh, something that has um, been associated with the type of kind of motivation yes. and uh, you know the, how you manage w what is your form of tough love to me it's more of a carrot and cane yeah, mm -hmm. kind of, okay if they are if they, they uh, follow the programs well and they show their positive attitude we we the slightest thing like giving them the little appreciation you know uh, so, but if they don't do well well i cannot Praise you if you don't do well, isn't it? Uh, you must uh, abide to all whatever our program. We have got uh, our counselor, we have got Ustaza, you know, here that come and help them. Sometimes initially they will show that they don't like all those things. Uh, but I got to be tough. I said, okay, you sit, whatever it is. You, you sit with them, you just follow first, and then if you cannot, then we will adjust. It's more of customized to the individual need here, you know, because we've got, got people from uh, colleges, you know, from universities, and we also got a person who cannot even read. Uh, so we've got to tune our approaches here. Now you were saying that there was an entrepreneur yes. um, in your midst. I mean, they left the home to become an entrepreneur. Can you talk to us about that story? Yes. Uh, she How came, did she come in and all? She came here on, with ambulance also. In fact, she brought the two children here. So, but she actually, she has already started a small business in a way, you know, uh, in the northern part of the uh, country. And uh, we, we were trying to help this uh, lady with the other children who's here, you know, big, big, uh, grown up children. So we house them, we, we locate for her, for, for her uh, different, we have got also other places, yeah? and uh, send the children to school. And then fortunately she responded very well because when she came here, she, she was so depressed. She was so like agitated, kind of, you know, uh, skinny, you know, no. typical of AIDS blown kiss, yeah. AIDS, full AIDS bloom. Uh, but Alhamdulillah, so when now, uh, every, she will always call me. Uh, so when she comes to Kuala Lumpur, make sure that we meet. You know. What is your message to mothers this Mother's Day? Yeah. They have got to be competent enough to face the challenge of the current life, you know. Uh, because uh, the way we lived before was definitely uh, different and then with all the gadget challenges, you know, with the social ills now, uh, especially when those who have already uh, somehow rather gone astray, some, you, know, you know, so more so now they have got to look care, care for their children.